Hello, everyone, this is Andy from Sopto. I am very glad that you can watch our video. Today we mainly introduce the classification and production process of optical cables. Based on their different applications, there are four different types of fiber cable aerial overhead type, underground direct buried, duct type and drop cable. The first three types are usually used in metropolitan area networks and backbone networks, while drop cable is usually used for the last one mile of FTTH networks. First of all, we first introduce two types of overhead optical cables, figure 8 cables and ADSS cables. Figure 8 cable is a self-supporting overhead optical cable. We can see the diagram of the cable structure clearly that there is stranded messenger wire. Normally, they are 7 asterisk 1.0 um or 7 asterisk 1.2 um messenger wire and even can provide ODM service based on the customer requirements like 1.5 mm or others types. ADS optical cable is an all-de-electric self-supporting cable which can be installed on electrical poles. Sopto can provide single jacket and double jacket ADS cable with MDP, HDP and even a jacket for high voltage electrical poles from span 40 meters to 1500 meters or more. The optical cable used in the duct usually adopts the form of single layer sheath. GYTA and GYTS are the most used. GYTA adopts high quality aluminum tape armor, while GYTS adopts steel tape armor. Since the supporting force of steel strip will be greater than that of aluminum strip, GYTS will have better pressure resistance. GYTA has better antioxidant capacity and is suitable for humid environment. After introducing the duct optical cable, we will introduce our directly buried optical cable. Careful friends will find that GYTA-53 has only one more sheath than GYTA. Because the directly buried optical cable will be directly exposed in the external environment, we need multi-layer protection. In addition, we can also provide anti-gnawing, anti-termite and other special functions. These do not belong to our conventional optical cables. When customers have this demand, they can explain to me or our sales staff that we will provide you with application optical cables for special application scenarios. After introducing the types of optical cable, I believe you have a preliminary understanding of optical cable. So how to choose the lowest price and the best quality optical cable in our project and business. This is a concern of many customers. First of all, we should understand that the price of optical cable is mainly affected by the following aspects No. Of optical cable cores, structures, jacket materials and fiber types and so on. In addition, Sopto's optical fiber is produced by ourselves. We have a complete optical fiber production line. First, we need to fuse a huge optical fiber preform. Then it is continuously stretched into the shape of the optical fiber that we often see. Then we will test and select the fiber that does not meet the technical requirements and only the qualified fiber will enter the next step. Then we will install a coating on the produced optical fiber. Then, various types of optical cables are manufactured according to customer requirements. Finally, here are some photos of our factories. Fiber cable is one of our main products. We have our own fiber preform, fiber towers to pull the fiber and the fiber cable production lines. We can produce 80 meters fiber cable per minute. We all strive to ensure that customers can buy the most suitable optical cable with reasonable price for their application environment. I hope all of you can give Sopto a chance and we will try to do our best to support you.